Imagine that. I'm not actually playing video games. Hmm. Well, it does have to do with video games. This is mostly to kind of a shout out sort of thing, or at least a doing a request from a person from my school, and he wants to know something about Minecraft. Most importantly, how the heck do you do multiplayer in Minecraft, or how you I don't know whether it's setting up or logging in, but simply enough, I will show how you do it. So, first of all, you will need to open your internet browser, and it depends on whether your internet browser actually wants to work with you. Come on. Come on. Work. Come on. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Is it that hard? Come on. You're ruining the video. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my goodness. Work! This is what I have to deal with. Okay, kill that one. And then kill that one. Nothing? <sighs> Give me a moment. Alright. Back to where we were. Now that you've got your internet open, all you have to do is, first of all, go to Minecraft... Wow, really? Really? Alright, go to Minecraft Forum. I'm just going to choose one of these bookmarked things. Good grief. This thing moves slowly when I'm recording. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh, is this really going to be at the stop and record thing? From Alright, you know what? That's it. I'm making this a stop record thing. Hold on. Alright, and we're back. Now that you have gone to minecraftform.net, before we dive into this, you need to know a couple of things. First of all, if you don't have a Minecraft account, as in you have paid for it, you will not be able to, you know, log- well, how to say this, you can't play multiplayer basically. You are paying for multiplayer, and it's a one-time pay, you only need to pay it once, $26 or something like that. Fairly decent, it's not too bad. Alright, now, there are multiple different kinds of servers. Survival, creative, objective, hybrid. Hybrid is just basically multi-server, having combination of the other three over here. Objective is, well, you know, it's objective. You do an objective and therefore you get it done. Creative, you build stuff. Survival, you survive it. Simple as that. Uh, now, what you might need to do next is, you might need to scroll up a bit, and if you hopefully not nearly as likely as this, you will need to create a account over here in the corner up here in the upper right because otherwise you will not be able to post on the forums and this is key because most servers will require a couple of rules such as your username be and I don't know sometimes they require age because they don't want immature people on there basically just comply with what they want in the thread follow the rules whatever it is you need to do and uh, the reason why they especially require your in-game name, or IGN, is because of something called whitelisting, which is basically, it's a list of names of players, and if, you do, if your name is not on that list, you will not be able to get in that server. So, be sure to follow the requirements to get whitelisted on the server. Sometimes servers do not need, you know, or do not have whitelisted. They, those are called public servers, so yeah. Alright, now, done with that, let us this All right now that you got your server IP which by the way you get your server IP within a thread from minecraftform.net in the server section when you get it you need to open minecraft if minecraft will well no it's not so much as minecraft so much as magic launcher but also so much more as I can't believe I can't open stupid programs because of bandicam open at the same time why you no work why why? All right, just hold on a moment again. All right, now and have been whitelisted on that server. If that server has a whitelist. All you have to do is simply go to multiplayer button, and then, preferably, since that you are probably going to go to that server multiple times over, you're going to want to add a server. So. Server name, it doesn't really matter so much as the server name in here, you can call it whatever you want. But, in this case, ooh, advertisement. Let's see, uh, you put in the server address here, which is the server IP, also known as. 
so you put it in here you hit done when you're done you can also hide the address if you want to and if you messed up don't worry you don't need to delete it you can always just edit it so once you have it you can either double click or hit join server and assuming that you have been whitelisted and followed all the rules and everything else you should be in the server and it is simple as that to play multiplayer so thank you for watching even though this is just a short simple video next time I will actually be playing video games see you later